name is Israel Dresner, better known as Saya is my nickname. I'm the Rabbi Emeritus of Temple Beth Tikva in Wayne, New Jersey, and I've been uh, a lifetime supporter of uh, human rights. I was a supporter of Rabbi for Human Rights long before it came to America, when it was only Israeli, and uh, I've been a supporter for uh, basically because I'm Jewish. Uh, both. Jewish teaching and Jewish experience, uh, Judaism and Jewish history uh, have made me uh, a lifelong supporter of human rights. On, in terms of Jewish teaching, we were taught that uh, there's one humankind, one God, one humankind. doesn't say that uh, this one is superior and that one is inferior. Uh, all our children of God. or persecuted, a Jew should stand up and uh, do something about it to uh, free the persecuted, to free the uh, incarcerated. Uh, we fought against, uh, I mean, we, we struggled for freedom in Egypt in ancient times, and we've been doing it uh, ever since. Uh, uh, the commandment that is uh, uh, repeated most often in the Torah is the commandment with regard to the ger, the stranger, the minority group of person, whether it's a minority of house of worship or skin pigmentation or uh, uh, gender or sexual orientation or language or culture or, or ethnicity or what have you, or a, a state of health uh, uh, in terms of uh, uh, disability or uh, whatever. And uh, it's repeated over and over again. Uh, uh, the stranger that Hager uh, Shigaritka uh, Lotil Katsenu, the the stranger that uh, uh, lives with you, uh, you shall not persecute him. You shall not oppress him. Kigerim uh, heit in Beretz Mitzrayim, for you were strangers in the land of Egypt. Hager uh, Shigaritka. Uh, 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 the stranger that lives with you shall shall be unto you as the homeborn among you. Uh, and you shall love him as yourself. Get him heat and bed at the time, for you were slaves in the land of Egypt. I am the Lord your God. And it's over and over again repeated. One law for the stranger and for the homeborn, uh, for the citizen. Uh, on the other hand, uh, Jewish experience is we've been the butt of oppression, we've been the, of, uh, the, the, the butt of persecution. Uh, and uh, long before the Holocaust, uh, the Holocaust was uh, the, the most terrible. Uh, uh, but uh, so we should understand what it is to be a gear, what it is to be a stranger. And so uh, I've been on the, uh, I, I, uh, I, I think I'm the most arrested rabbi here. Uh, I've been arrested seven times in my life. And the first time I was still a teenager when I was in Habonim, uh, protesting against uh, the British uh, not letting uh, uh, so-called illegal immigrants through to uh, what was then the British Mandate of Palestine. Uh, what were the other they, six they, times? They didn't, they didn't book us. They took us to the police station, but they didn't book us because we were all underage. And the police in those days were sort of, uh, they were pro-Zionists, not because they knew anything about Zionism, but the, in those days they were all anti-British because they were all Irish. There were no black policemen, there were no Hispanic policemen and so forth. Uh, I was arrested four times in the South and sat in jail. Those were the four times I was actually in jail. The other three times, uh, once in Washington, once in New York, at the, uh, once at the uh, Soviet Embassy in Washington, once at the uh, South African Consulate in New York, uh, we weren't uh, actually put in jail uh, uh, for those. Uh, we, we were tried, but uh, uh, so, but the four that uh, I was uh, in jail for, one of them actually went up to the U.S. Supreme Court, has my name on it, Dresner, Ed Al, and others, Ed Al, versus Tallahassee. And uh, I sat in the court and heard the oral argument, but we should know better than to uh, have Jews uh, persecuting someone else. And uh, uh, 
I've been a Zionist, I've been a dupe paying, card carrying Zionist for 1942, that's 50, 68 years, you know? And uh, since I joined Habonim, and uh, 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 Zionism today has been corrupted and corroded. Uh, it's not the Zionism that I knew when I first became a Zionist, and it's not the Zionism that built, uh, uh, you know, that, that founded and built the State of Israel. And, uh, and we have to uh, correct it. We have to reform it. We have to change the, you know, the policies of uh, the annexationist policies of annex annexing land and annexing people and annexing houses and uh, uh, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera.